Hey y'all, what's up? What's up, what's up, what's up? How y'all doing this morning? Happy Friday. Happy Friday, today's March 1st. Y'all, today's a new month. Mm, spring is coming. Mm, I love it, my favorite time. The springtime when things just are nice and new and flowers are blooming. And, yeah, nah, I love that time of year. Yeah, Spirit, what's this message for my collective? Remember the time is fluid, so whenever you see this message or hear this message, it's when you're meant to see it. It's a general reading. It may, may not resonate with everyone watching, but that's all good. There's other videos. Hit the like button. Subscribe. Okay. Only take what resonates and leave the rest. Happy Friday again. Let's see what's going on, my collective spirit. Hmm. Anything they need to know for this day? What you need to know? What does the collective need to know for this Friday spirit? Please and thank you. <laughs> I'm hearing evil eyes always watching. <laughs> That's what I heard. You were I always watching. Hmm. People could love your honesty. That's what I'm hearing. What we got here? The Hierophant. Okay, now. All right. Could be speaking to an earth sign. Don't have to be. People love your honesty. Mm -hmm. They admire how you speak your truth. Hmm. But all evil... Evil eyes are always watching, I heard. Yes. Mm -hmm. You have a lot of jewels, a lot of wisdom. Yeah. And I feel like you that wisdom comes from, you know, a collective of, you, you know, lessons and your spirituality and you standing in your truth, you know, your integrity. It's like you wear, it's like you got a, a crown of, of roses around your head, like, you know, like the thorn thing that Jesus had on his head. It's like a rose bush, and that's, that's um, spiritual wisdom and connection with the divine, all right? Mm hmm You could have tattoos along your upper torso region. It's like... Ooh, I heard Joan of Arc. You know what I'm saying? It's like you're, you're ahead of your time. Yes. It's like you're not the traditional um, hierophant kind of energy where it'd be like the Pope or something like that. You're more modern. And I say that because with the tattoos and, you know, the way you dress, it's like you're, you're, you're yourself. But you also, you're connected to the divine. You're a woman of... This time. Oh, I said woman. Okay. You're a woman of this time. Thank you, spirit. Mm. Mm. But you definitely carry ancient wisdom. Mm -hmm. mm. Rebel. We have a king of pentacles here. <clears throat> Somebody very focused on their finances, their stability, their investments. Someone could be, you know, um, to themselves. Somebody could live a, like a distance from the community. Six of swords on the bottom of the deck, nine of swords. Mm, some kind of regret. Being having to move away to karma waters, having to leave things behind, having to let go of disappointment, losses. You know what I'm saying? Anything that you know you feel like, you know, that you've outgrown. Let's put it like that. We'll say it like that. Anything you could feel like you've outgrown. Spirit, what's this message? It's real. What's his message? I'm turn this down a little bit. It's real. What's his message?
press it because it's actually going to try to come like this. Hmm. Excuse me, what's this message? High priest, come on now. Wow. Hmm. This is your energy. This is, I'm definitely talking to an earth sign. Mm-hmm. Yeah. High priestess. You have, you have ancient wisdom. You have passed down knowledge. Royalty. Royal, um, information. You have the, you have dark and light knowledge. Mm, come on, spirit. It's like you sit on the cusp of the darkness and the light. Come on now. Listen, tower. Ooh wee. Tower moment. What's this message? Ooh, look at these trying to cut. They did come out. All right. We have ten of swords that came on out, slid out. All these fell out. Oh my goodness. We have the ten of pentacles. We'll just put them down there. Ten of cups. Ace, Ace of Cups, whoo, the Sun, <laughs> wow, the Six of Wands, the Knight of Cups, Justice, Nine of Swords, Seven of Wands, King of Wands, jeez, Louis, what's at the bottom of the deck, the Hangman and the Nine of Pentacles, alright, what's going on here, so we see some kind of Betrayal, letdown, disappointments, backstabbing, you know. Yeah, a lot of uh, attacks. I'm going to say it like that. But this is done. This is over because that's ten. That's ten swords. Mm -hmm. Whatever whatever the situation was, whatever was done is over. It's done, you know. It's almost like what's done is done. You can't, you know, you can't change the past. You can only move forward, you know what I mean? You can only move forward. This definitely could be family. You got the Ten of Pentacles and the Ten of Cups and the Ace of Cups and the Sun. This is about family. This is about a betrayal from family. This is about a lot of... Um, a lot of actions that were taken to... To bring you down, to to uh, assassinate your character, to have you in darkness. You understand what I'm saying? But you're not of darkness. You you sit on the cusp of darkness and light. You're very balanced in your life. You 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 got information. You got knowledge from the darkness. You got information and knowledge from the light. Okay. Mm. Very grounded energy. Very spiritual energy, okay? This is somebody that's highly, highly spiritual. I'm just going to put it to you just like that. Okay, period. Okay, you could do something online as well. I heard tarot. <laughs> I heard tarot. Yeah, you, you have knowledge. You have spiritual knowledge. Mm-hmm. Mm. Yeah, but there's been a lot of attacks on your character, on, on you as a person, on what you say. They've been attacking what you wear, your clothes. Possibly uh, isolating you. Like, yeah, these, you were definitely singled out, for sure. And this could be definitely by your family with the son here as well. You're going to, you know, things are going to be exposed. Mm-hmm. We got the six of sword six of wands, I'm sorry. Mm-hmm. Victory. People see you as, you know, um someone they look up to. You know. Someone that's overcome a lot of obstacles, you know. Somebody that's that has fought and overcome so many challenges, you know. Then we have somebody from your family with this Knight of Cups under the Ten of Cups that wants to come in and, and uh, make an offer or offer some kind of um, olive, olive branch kind of energy. 
and it's possibly because they feel regret for those swords. This could be one individual that did put in nine swords, you know, in your back. But this is justice for an injustice that this person has to come in and apologize. They don't have to. Everybody has free will, but they've been thinking about it. They could be caught up in something, feeling like they're stuck somewhere or some way, and now maybe you're the only way out. Or that's so they think. You know, they're trying to figure out how to come and apologize because they know there was an injustice when all you gave was unconditional love. Whew. Then we got the seven of wands, very somebody very guarded, king of wands, hmm, deceitful kind of energy, very abrasive energy. I feel like this person's carrying a grudge against you, some kind of um, torch. That's how, that's the energy I'm picking up. Somebody's been carrying some kind of anger. Look how they, they, they clench fist. You hear me? They don't, they don't want people to know it, to recognize it, but you can recognize it in this person's body language. Mm-hmm. They mad because you were able to defend yourself. That's what they mad about. The seven of wands. Mm-hmm. Yep. They're mad because you were able to defend yourself from all those swords that they tried to put into your back. Yep. And people still look up to you and people still admire you. Mm-hmm. Look. They wondered how they can try to come back in now. Because now they see you as somebody that's very strong, very independent. You don't care about what people think. You go your own way. You making your own way. Your own stability. You're very creative. You're building your pinnacles. You're building your own stability. You hear me? You mind your business. Come on. Yeah. That's what they see. Spirit, what's this message? What's going on here for the collective? Ooh. Look at that. Two of Pentacles. Right under the justice. Hmm. This could be juggling, but this could all... Shit, nine of cups. I don't, this is you juggling multiple incomes. That's what that is, because those are pinnacles that you are juggling. And look how you dress. You posing for the photos. Look at this. Come on now. Making it look easy. Come on, spirit. Mm -hmm, because you're standing in green grass in a meadow where things are blooming. Come on now. That's your justice. Look. Nine of cups. You can sit on your bench by yourself. You can't sit at my table. Right? Ain't that's how they did it for you? you they, you couldn't sit at their table. Hmm. Come on, spirit. What's this mess? Look, and now they stuck. Because they know. Those are all those swords that they trapped themselves in. All the gossip. Everything that they said. Now, if they were to try to come back towards you, they can't. They stuck because they done told too many lies. They done set themselves out. They locked themselves out. Because you're being seen as somebody that's very um, admirable in the community. Somebody that people see that came from the bottom and now you're here. And that, that's not to say that you're better than anybody. But people have seen you overcome your challenges in life. Challenges and, and overcome each of those swords that were put in your back. Each one of those swords you proved to be wrong. You prove somebody to be a liar and they know it and they need to come in and apologize. They don't want to because they're very immature. This is a night. And this is somebody I'm feeling like that it's not really sorry about what they did either. Because they look like the way they look on this card. It's like they give them the cup but they really don't want to. They really don't feel no remorse. They're really not ready to repent. So that means this is somebody that's holding on to some, some underlying anger. Some underlying emotions. Yeah, they done did a lot. This is how they wanted you. They wanted you to be trapped because of all the lies and, and, and things they said, but they ended up trapping themselves. They didn't see it blindfolded hmm. from doing things and acting, you know, out of their emotions hastily. Hastily, you know, not thinking. 
Wanting to win at all costs, I'm hearing. Shreya, what's this message? Anything else for my collective? <clears throat> Shreya, what's this message? Ooh. This cycle's complete. It's over. It's a wrap. Look. There you go. They go your wisdom are wrapped around your waist and on your head. You got control of the beast. Hmm. Hmm. I heard you walk with your dark side on a leash. Come on now. But anyway, you've learned the lesson. Ooh, look, Ace of Pentacles on the bottom of the deck. You learned the lesson that was needed to be learned. The cycle is complete. You you chose yourself. You overcame what was meant to keep you in a never-ending cycle. You overcame it. And people admire you for that. They see your strength and your wisdom. You hear me? Come on, spirit. Ace of Pentacles, Two of Cups. You listen. Options. Balance. What did I say? This is you. You're tempered. Your energy is tempered. You pour into others. This is what balances you out. You don't take your energy and, and try to hurt people. You take your energy and you try to heal people. And that, in turn, the universe balances it out for you. So it goes around and you flow and you're in a new cycle. Where you get equal give and take. Spirit. And not having people around you trying to tear you down behind your back. You know, these are people that are not... <laughs> come on, you already know they're cowards. If they smiling in your face and then trying to backstab you behind your back, they're cowards. You know, and they and they still trying to stay up in your energy. Why? You know, that's what you really got. Well, if people don't really like you, why are they up in your energy, right? Why? Because you got something that they want. Spirit, what's this message? And they want to tear you down. Look, we got judgment over here in a whole nother deck. <laughs> Look at that. Look, and then I, well, that's the seven of pentacles. Ooh, the empress. Hey, well, let's stay over here. Stay over here. Stay over here. <laughs> What's this message, spirit? Ace of Pentacles, the sun, wish fulfillment, happiness, mm -hmm. stability. For real. Page of Pentacles. Mm -hmm. I feel like this could be you. Death card. Mm -hmm. The Hermit. Endings. Ooh, and the Tower. Look at that. Somebody could be watching you on the internet because there's an ending here. There's a tower. Yeah, the structure's coming down from your past. Yes, you, things are not the same. You you don't even see your life the same anymore with this cycle closing out. There was a lot of hard lessons that you had to learn, but you did it. You did it. And the universe is rewarding you for that. That means your reward is that you completed this cycle. You know, you gained the knowledge that you needed to gain to move forward, to elevate, to, to, to experience new things in life, you know. Yeah, so that you don't have to carry the baggage from the past. And this is your, your freedom to, you know, create what you want in life. No strings attached. Hello. Mm-hmm. No strings attached. No baggage. See, see, the the betrayal was meant to be seen before you got to this to this level. Because had you not seen it, you would have been trying to carry along people that were going to be continually trying to tear you down every time you try to move up. That's why it's being revealed right now, so you can release. You can see people for who they are and move forward. Death card. Thank you, spirit. What else is here? Anything else before I close this out? Night of Swords, people are mad. They don't like it. They don't like it that you get this new beginning. Listen, that you get this cherry, that you get to move forward. They don't like it. Look at but judgment is here. I cannot make this up. Judgment is being called. You have made a call on all involved, and that's the truth. On everyone involved in your life that may have come against you. Now they know. Now they know because they can't move forward with you. They showed their hand. They're tied to the choices that they made. They see it now. They're getting it now. Hmm. All right. That's it for me, y'all. I'll see you.
Deuces. <laughs>